In today's video, we are going to be studying amines, and here we have the outline of what we'll be discussing. What are amines and basicity? Now, amines are organic compounds that contain a carbon-nitrogen bond, and the nitrogen atom has a lone pair of electrons, and it also has the ability to form three bonds with other atoms, which could be carbon, or hydrogen okay so let's take an example where we have carbon on one hand of the nitrogen and hydrogen attached on the other sides okay so we have something like this now this amine being a one carbon amine and having an alkyl group with the name methyl is named methyl amine okay this is an example of an amine and of course it forms a homologous series of compounds now nitrogen atom the nitrogen atom also has the ability to replace the carbon atom in an aromatic hydrocarbon Okay, so take for example, we have a benzene ring. Now, a benzene ring would usually have something like this, six carbon atoms with double bonds that are conjugated. Okay, so something like this. Now, the benzene ring or aromatic hydrocarbons in general are cyclic organic compounds okay and in our very first video of this series we saw that cyclic organic compounds can be divided into homocyclic and heterocyclic now homocyclic organic compounds are organic compounds that contain only one type of atom in the ring structure Okay, so it contains just one type of atom in the ring structure. And of course, because it's an organic compound, the atom type is a carbon. Okay, so homocyclic organic compounds contain only carbon atoms in the ring, just as we have here in benzene. The ring contains only carbon atoms. Now, nitrogen is able to replace a carbon atom in this ring in some cyclic amines okay and so we'd have something like this right carbon and another carbon of course it's conjugated so another carbon then we have nitrogen here with its lone pairs then we have a double bond and another carbon atom here now this particular amine is called a pyridine okay and it basically has a nitrogen atom forming part of the ring structure since we have more than one atom forming part of the ring in other words we have both carbon and nitrogen forming part of the ring structure it is referred to as a heterocyclic organic compound okay so let's take a look at the basicity of amines now due to the presence of the lone pair of electrons present on the nitrogen atoms amines are able to act as lewis bases Okay, now a Lewis base is simply an electron pair donor. Okay, an electron pair donor. And just in the same way as ammonia acts as a base, the amine, the nitrogen atom present in amine enables it to act as a base. So if we have the the amine methyl amine 
with the structure CH3 and of course with the nitrogen and hydrogen here and hydrogen here okay so it's able to act as an electron pair donor so if we have a hydrogen atom or rather a hydrogen ion now this hydrogen ion is a proton okay and the hydrogen ion has no electron okay it's just an empty orbital and so this lone pair of electrons are able to be shared with this hydrogen ion and this is a coordinate bond okay it's a coordinate bond and so what we would have is something that looks like this we would have our methyl here and the new hydrogen hydrogen and hydrogen okay and this ion has positive charge okay and it has the name methyl ammonium ion okay so this is all about the basicity of amines if you enjoyed this video if you liked this video please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe Thank you for watching till the end.